Kansas Music Review. And we're getting stone free with Eric Clapton tonight. You hear me? The old Jimi Hendrix tune that he redid for a um, Jimi Hendrix tribute album years ago. My favorite version of this song. But before we go any further, if you would please go to YouTube and like and subscribe and comment on YouTube or go to Rumble and Rumble follow and comment on Rumble would be greatly appreciated. So, Jimmy uh, Hendrix's version of Stone Free, great version, but I like the Clapton version better. I know. That's almost sacrilegious. Um, but, you know, to some people, Clapton is God. Uh, <clears throat> Eric just released a new uh, album, actually, it's not a, of old material, Rarities, from 83 to 98. And uh, it's an eight song disc or streaming or, you know, coming out on vinyl in a box set of the Reprise Records uh, box studio albums. Um, and this is volume one. This will be volume one. <coughs> eight songs. First song is Stone Free, of course, the Jimi Hendrix tune. Um, then the second song, two songs. Second song is Crossroads. And the third song is White Room, both live from Birmingham, England in 86. Then four is Theme from a Movie That Never Happened. It's a beautiful instrumental. Um, really dig it a lot. Five, and I don't know why they put this one on here, other than the original version was recorded between 83 and 98, but this is a 2020 remix of that song, Pilgrim, which is a great remix, but it's not from that time era because you remixed it in 2020. So I don't understand that. Um, six is 3220 Blues, and seven is Country Jail Blues. Both of those were recorded live at the Royal Albert Hall in 83. Uh, and number eight is just that old, good old traditional blues song called Born Under a Bad Sign. And he's a bad man because he plays guitar like no other. Um, if you're an Eric Clapton fan, it's worth listening to. It's worth getting at least getting the uh, download. Uh, because these are rare tracks that you won't find in any other places other than maybe, like I said, the Stone Free was originally on a Jimi uh, Hendrix tribute album that came out in the late 80s, I think it was. Actually, no, it was in the 90s. Um, but that, that was <clears throat> uh, a great version. And these other things, just good, good solid music to listen to if you're a boomer like me, or if you're a young kid wanting to get into rock and roll, you can't get any better than Eric Clapton playing blues rock. So if you like what I have to say here today, please like and subscribe and comment on YouTube and rumble and follow and comment on Rumble. So till next time, see ya.